Doomsday of Dead, it's a game that incorporates the ever popular zombie survival team into a MMORPG. So in today's video, I'll show you how you can download and install this game on your PC with Bluestacks, and all the many features and advantages that come with that. When it comes to playing your favorite Android games on the PC, there is no better way than to use Bluestacks. So, to install Doomsday of Dead, firstly, head out to the Bluestacks official website to download and install the latest Bluestacks 5 version on your PC. Now, proceed to the installation process, and once you're done, you can go to the Play Store and log in into your Google account. You need to provide your email address and then the password, and then proceed to agree with everything that shows up. And once you're done logging in, you'll be brought to the Play Store, where you can search for Doomsday of Dead here on the search bar on the top. Select Doomsday of Dead and click install, just like you would on your regular phone. And once installation is finished, the icon will pop up here on the home screen. Just click on it and start playing. But now that we know how to download and install Doomsday of Dead on your PC, let's take a look on why Bluestacks is the definite way to go when it comes to playing this game on the PC. The key mapping tool allows you to use your keyboard and mouse and even customize the whole control scheme to your liking. So instead of having to drag the mouse and press all over the screen, you can assign specific keys to certain points on the screen to simulate a touch action. For Doomsday, this means that you can walk around without the need of the auto path system, so that you can use the WASD keys to enjoy the scenery and all the zombies that come with that. And this can be very useful to allow more advanced tactics, such as kiting when fighting a huge wave of zombies. So to access this feature, just press this keyboard icon right here on the side panel. And here you have a lot of options, such as previewing the current controls or proceeding to advanced options to fine tune everything to your liking by dragging and dropping all the keys you want on top of the functions you need. The Multi Instance Manager is a great way to maximize playing idle games on Bluestacks. This basically allows you to open two or even more games at the same time and play them actively while being able to monitor the progress being made in each instance. This means that you can play off your favorite games without the need to choose between one or the other. And this is great with Doomsday of that because it allows you to skip the boring parts of the game, such as auto-questing and let it run by itself while you play other games without missing any important progression. So to access this feature, just click on this icon right here on the side panel and then you can create and run as many instances of Bluestacks as you like. The Macro Tool is another neat feature that allows you to record and replay a series of commands as many times as you wish. And even though Doomsday of Dead has a lot of auto features already in game, this means that you can even automate daily challenges or quests to help you out a lot in skipping the less interesting parts of the game. So to access this feature, just click on this icon right here on the side panel and then create a new macro. Perform whichever action you want to save and once you're done, click stop right here on the top. And now, just assign a name and then a key for it. And if you press on this gear icon, you can even customize the many times you want this action to be repeated and many other things. This game is quite fun and its uniqueness only adds to old and new MMORPG fans. There's a lot of strategy and thinking involved and you will definitely test your abilities to adapt to different situations to survive when hordes of zombies are hunting you rentless. And of course, if you want to streamline your gameplay experience even further and have access to a ton of awesome features, Bluestacks is the way to go. But yeah, that brings us to the end of another video. Thank you very much for watching and bye bye!